Today we're going to learn about how to find the shaded area of the figure in the rectangle. Let's say we have a problem to solve, like the perimeter of the square P is 32 centimeters. The rectangle is 14 centimeters long and 12 centimeters wide. Find the shaded area of the figure. This is the rectangle that is 14 centimeters long, 12 centimeters wide. And this is square P. It says in the problem that the perimeter of square P is 32 centimeters. So let's write down that the perimeter of square P of square P is 32 centimeters. So, we also know that the perimeter of square P of square P is equal to 4 times the length of square P. 4 times the length. With or 4L. So this means that 4L is equal to 32 centimeters. Is equal to 32 centimeters. So L is equal to 32 divided by 4, which is eight centimeters. So the area of the square P, the area of square P is equal to, we know that the area of a square is the length times the length. And the length of square P is eight centimeters. So is equal to 8 times 8, which is equal to 64 centimeters square. So, the area of the square P is equal to 64 centimeters square. 64 centimeters square. Now let's find the area of the rectangle. The formula for finding the area of the rectangle is the area of the rectangle is equal to the length times the width, which is equal to, the length of the rectangle is 14 centimeters, so 14 times the width, which is 12 centimeters. So times 12 is equal to 168 centimeters squared. So, the area of the square, or the area of the rectangle, I mean, is equal to 168 centimeters square. Now, when we take away this square P, there is a diagonal line that cuts through the rectangle. It divides the rectangle into two halves, this side and this side. So this means that because square P is a square, that this shaded part of the rectangle is equal to the un this unshaded part of the rectangle. Let's write that down. The area of the shaded of that shaded part of the rectangle 
is equal to this unshaded part of the rectangle. It's equal to the area of this unshaded part of the rectangle. So, this means that the area of the shaded part, which is this part, is equal to the area of the rectangle minus the area of the square over 2. So this is equal to the area of the rectangle, which is 168 centimeters squared, 168 centimeters, 168 centimeters squared, minus the area of the square, which is 64 centimeters squared, so minus 64 over 2. This is equal to 104 over 2. Because 168 minus 64 is equal to 104 over 2. Over 2. 104 over 2 is equal to 52. Because 104 divided by 2 is 52. Centimeters Square. So the area of the shaded part, the area of the shaded part is equal to fifty two centimeters squared. Let's write that right here. shaded part, the area of the shaded part is equal to 52 centimeters square. 52 centimeters square. Today we learned about how to find the shaded area of the figure in the rectangle. Thank you for watching this video.